Okay, thank you so much. All right, so I got my packages and now I'm headed to deliver. Let's ride. Okay, the issues that can occur. So I'll let you know, this is a new one for me, but maybe somebody will be able to relate. Get to the customer's address for the package drop off. Both packages are theirs. Go up to their home. They have a no contact request, which I completely respect. No text, no calls. And I did not do either. Get to their location, knock on their door. Um, they have a request from Uber to collect the signature. So in order for me to leave their items, I must collect their signature, which confirms that in fact they did receive it. Now that's not a request for all customers. So I'm not really sure how that particular request gets on a person's account or if it's completely random. But in this case, they requested that I collect the signature prior to leaving the items. So I continue to knock pause no response knock pause no response i'm there for like five minutes knocking announcing myself that i need to collect their signature no response now i am back in the car with the items and currently calling uber tech support why because i can't leave the items here because i can't confirm the delivery which means the person can say they never received it even when i did leave it and i can't get released from this order to get additional deliveries or even be instructed to take the merchandise back to walmart without somebody clearing me of this delivery so i'm in the parking lot on hold with customer support yep Glad I got coffee. <laughs> um, one order says leave at door, and the other order says ask for signature. Those are the only options it provides me. Then when I go on to. All right, so I am currently off the phone with Uber support and to let you know how things finalized. Well, they confirmed in fact that what I was mentioning was correct. I was at the location. No one answered to um, allow me to collect the signature. And so I had to be removed from the delivery. Now in order for me to receive any additional deliveries, I have to take these merchandises back to Walmart. Thank goodness they're only probably about mm, four, four miles or so from their address. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and return those items and I get paid for both deliveries fully because it wasn't my fault that they didn't unfortunately answer to collect the signature. Now I will say this, I don't know for certain, however, um, in this particular scenario, potentially the customer was there and just wanted me to leave the items without answering the door so they could say that they weren't delivered. Anyhow, I'm getting paid. I hate that I can't deliver it for them because I know how I am when I order something. I mean, you guys too, right? You want your items. But I'm taking them back to the store and then on to the next. Sometimes it works out, sometimes it doesn't. We're gonna pull right back up at slot number 10. We're back. 